In the mid-1980s, Eyal travels abroad, introducing Krav Maga to people in countries around the globe, first in the United States and then in Europe. He teaches the system to elite military and law enforcement units as well as to civilians. In order to manage the challenge of spreading Krav Maga beyond Israel's borders, Eyal founds the International Krav Maga Federation and serves as its chairman and head instructor under the tutelage and support of Grandmaster Imi. Imi regarded Eyal as family and as the natural choice for leadership of the Krav Maga system. For this purpose, Imi awarded him with the Founders Diploma of Excellence and the first ever rank of Expert 8, the highest rank awarded to a Krav Maga practitioner. Imi Steor Lichtenfeld passed away in 1998 at the age of 88. To the day he died, Grandmaster Imi served as mentor and spiritual guide for Eyal Yanilov, and together they enhanced and developed Krav Maga. Since Imi's death, Eyal has taken upon himself the responsibility of leading and developing Krav Maga and taking it to the next level. He trains instructors and staff all over the world and has created a global infrastructure for disseminating the system. In practice, Eyal has trained all of the world's first-generation Krav Maga instructors. At present, a team of elite instructors, the global team, is assisting him in spreading the knowledge and the system of Krav Maga to numerous countries around the world. In addition to the many civilians training in Krav Maga centers, Military and police special forces from around the world have also adopted Krav Maga as taught by Eyal and his team as their preferred hand-to-hand -hand combat and tactical defense system. Over the years, the global network of Krav Maga branches has increased substantially along with the numbers of practitioners and instructors. Different offshoots developed, all training under the umbrella name of Krav Maga. The International Krav Maga Federation, which was founded as a sports association, could barely meet the various changing needs of the times, and it became impossible neither to develop Krav Maga within the IKMF nor to preserve the moral and professional spirit outlined by Imi. Therefore, Eyal decided, along with others, to harness his vast experience in Krav Maga, close to 40 years in the field, and founded Krav Maga Global, the KMG. KMG is the vehicle for Eyal and his team to disseminate and promote Krav Maga in an ethical, unique and uncompromising manner activities in various countries and close contact with those in the field enable tactical and technical growth and development suitable for each location and particular set of circumstances. Today, years after the passing of Grandmaster Imi, Krav Maga Global carefully supervises the professionalism of its instructors and the quality of instruction at all levels. Insistence on the highest moral and professional standards preserves the spirit and original path of Krav Maga's founder.